After that, you have your slug. Essentially, your slug is part of your URL. So my URL for my website, of course, is chandlersear.com. My URL or my slug in this case, in relation to this article, would be an extension of that URL. So what it would look like would be chandlersear.com forward slash, and then I could be whatever I would like. In this case, I'm going to, again, put it as my top three free digital marketing tools in 2023. I'm doing this just to keep everything concise and also well put together. I don't want to put it, for example, as my top three tools or my top three marketing tools, whatever it may be. I want to put everything so it's the exact same thing throughout so it looks concise. So if someone's searching for it, it appears naturally and it appeals very fast. So for example, in my slug here, I'm going to paste the exact same thing, my free uh, my uh, top three free digital marketing tools in 2023. Whenever you're creating a slug, you do have to have a hyphen in between all the spaces. So all the spaces will be replaced with hyphens. So in this case right here, we would put my top three free digital marketing tools in 2023, and there will be uh, the hyphens 